RSV. Okay. Uh, kids who get it somehow seem to be more like having asthma attacks or wheezing attacks after we're over. Is that possible? RSV, respiratory syncytial virus, is a virus that causes a condition known as bronchiolitis in children under the age of two. Bronchiolitis is a condition where the child is wheezing and has difficulty breathing for a period of seven to 10 days. What we know is that the RSV virus does cause some damage to the lining of the lung, and that lining can take many months to fully heal. During that period, the patient is certainly susceptible to have repeated episodes of wheezing with any other viral infection that may occur. What we're also seeing is that these children who've had wheezing with their RSV infection do have an increased risk to have repeated periods of wheezing even out until they're five, six, or seven years of age. Sometimes these children are diagnosed as asthma, when in fact it's the result of the RSV infection, and after they reach that point, somewhere between five and seven, they outgrow their wheezing disease. Once you diagnose the infection clinically, doing the nasal smear test to, to prove that it's RSV helps to identify the cause of that episode of bronchiolitis, since other viruses can cause bronchiolitis as well. Knowing that it was RSV infection certainly allows us to be prepared for these repeated wheezing episodes that can occur her with RSV infection specifically. Once this nasal smear test is done once, however, and is proven to be positive, there's really no need to repeat the test. The patient will recover from the infection within a seven to 10 day period, and repeating the test would not help us plan treatment or predict outcomes.